Hello guys, I'm back with some more boxing. I hope everyone is okay, doing great. So let me talk about Amir Khan versus Canelo. Now that's the fight, you know, that's a really tough fight for Amir Khan because Canelo is going to make it rough. So, you know, there are a few things Amir Khan, Amir Khan cannot afford to make, you know, when it comes to mistakes against Canelo because Canelo is a middleweight champ. you going up to weird classes to fight Canelo. You know, he's not a welterweight. You know, his punches are strong. He's strong, son of a gun. You know, he's big. He's huge. You know, he can... You know, he, Canelo is just one of them guys you can punch and take a soul out, you know, even if if you don't have a great chin. You know, Amir Khan hasn't got a great chin. As we all know, he's got a decent chin. You know, and Canelo is a very tough puncher. You know, he's, he's like fighting two Maidanas at the same time. You know, Canelo is a double plus, you know. Amir Khan needs to be more, uh, you know, needs to focus, needs to come with at least two or three plans, game plans. He needs to adopt and, uh, you know, handle the situation. He needs to do what Mayweather did. But I think Canelo is more experienced now. He's, he knows what to do and he's going to he's gonna find a way. You know, he's going to find a way. First thing I would like to say, Amir Khan, you know, first thing for him would be, you know, not to lose his speed and quickness by putting on too much weight, you know, putting on too much muscle and, you know, he, his calves, hamstring and glutes needs to be pulled, built to help his leg strength, you know. And one thing I, would, uh, I really want to say is he cannot afford to exchange, you know, with this guy because this guy is a beast, you know. You know, this guy is a beast. You know, Amir Khan is strong, but, you know, Canelo punches are, you know, like 10 times stronger than Amir Khan's. Canelo's got the power to hurt Amir Khan, to hurt anyone, Amir. But, you know, you know that the only advantage Amir Khan has is, you know, the footwork. Canelo hasn't got decent footwork. He's slow, flat-footed. So... He needs to, you know, he needs to throw one, two, and, you know, he doesn't need to stay in pocket for long because, uh, you know, this is not a good ta uh, tactics. And the other thing he cannot afford is to stand on the ropes and, you know, take punishment because Canelo is a great body puncher, you know. If you don't believe me, ask James Kirkland. We all saw what happened. Amir Khan... Another thing I mean, can't can't afford in this ring, you know, with the, this fight is try to hold Canelo because Canelo is not gonna hold back and you know just let the referee do the job and you know he's gonna punch he's gonna keep punching it he's gonna go to the body I know that's because uh, he he likes to punch in the body Canelo and uh, the last thing I wanna say is don't exchange at the wrong time you know I mean, can't should just doesn't need to exchange at all he needs to just throw one two three and move out throw one two three and move out don't stay in pocket too long like he always does otherwise it's gonna be like Danny Garcia versus Amir Khan all again but this guy is not Danny Garcia he's Canelo and he can punch you out he can take you out with one punch you know so th that's a very tough fight for Amir Khan he needs to come back. He needs to come in the ring with at least three or four plans. Because one plan is not going to work. Two plans are not going to work. At least he has two, three options. You know, he needs to adopt. He needs to adjust. Because Canelo is going to come like a train. And he's a bigger guy anyways. You know, it looks easy on the paper. But in the ring, Han, Han needs to be more disciplined. And follow these instructions that Canelo is coming at him. He's going to come at like a train, you know, bullet train. So he needs to be more careful. Amir Khan cannot afford a single mistake in this match. Amir Khan likes to make mistakes, but this guy is no Chris Algieri. This guy is no Damon Alexander. You know, Amir needs to be on his number one game, you know, if he wants to win this. He needs to be more disciplined. He needs to, he needs to get through this fight. You know, if he can make it to the last round, he will win. That's 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 what I believe. He can win.
If Canelo wants to win, he has to knock Amir Khan out, which is very likely. You know, I think Amir Khan should be able to, you know, shouldn't be, you know, at least at least Khan will keep, make it entertaining, you know. But if Amir Khan can capitalize on, you know, these mistakes, he, if he doesn't make these mistakes, stand on the ropes, try to hold or, uh, you know, exchange at the wrong time, stay in pocket for long, I think Amir Khan has a decent chance. But, you know, Canelo is no joke. You know, Amir Khan is moving up to weight classes. I don't know why he's moving up to weight classes by Canelo when Danny Garcia fight was there. But anyways, the fight is made. I really hope Amir Khan come victorious, which is very unlikely. But, you know, I really hope they put on a good show. You know, I hope Amir Khan lost the whole fight, you know, just to prove their uh, haters wrongs. You know about his glass chin and all that rubbish you know he, he's got a decent chin but you know this guy can punch let me know guys what you think comment subscribe peace